Hi. Hi. Finally, some company. <laughs> <laughs> Even if it's not Boo Boo who is so late. Hi. How are you? I'm good. So tell us, what are you up to these days? <sighs> um, I just finished filming in okay. Enugu. That was quite the experience. Um, I've been taking some time out and now I'm back and um, just chilling until I start filming again, catching up with friends that are abandoning me in their store. <laughs> <laughs> are these one of the ways you unwind? Yes, it is. Okay. What does your name mean? <laughs> I laugh because I don't know, it makes me Google all the time. Okay. So my full name is actually Imi Bokum and it is the story of a bird. Hmm. Yes. That's it? No, no. Do I try to tell you the story? Well, okay, let me tell you the story. I'm actually proud of the story. So, Iniboko is this white, apparently beautiful bird. And whenever she comes to the riverbank, all of the other birds clear out for her to dive in and just stare at her in awe and amazement. <laughs> okay. So, so, <laughs> so, I mean, I guess it means beauty, grace, you know, embodies all of that. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Most ridiculous nickname someone ever gave you? Huh. <laughs> Any bomb bomb. Okay, that's funny. I know. Sorry. <laughs> it's fine. Who's your Nigerian celebrity crush? Hmm. Um... I would say Genevieve. I mean, she's a woman, but I love her so much. Um, so yeah, I just love everything. I've loved her since I was a kid, and you know, everything she represents, all she's achieved. Yeah, she's a boss. Um, so while we're here, this is literally one of my favorite places to be. It's the I Am Isigo showroom, and what's special is that Bubu literally does all of this by herself. So she picks like household items you can find anywhere. She turns it to this amazing space. So since I'm here all by myself, I might as well show you around. I actually love this store. I know it's it's amazing. Let's 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 look around. Just complete the sentence. Style is style is freedom. What's your favorite fashion trend? Huh. Well, right now I'm really into plaid. And it looks good on you. Thank you. <laughs> and I know you're always slim, so what outfit are you rocking on that rack? Look, I'm actually here because I think I just got drawn here because I haven't seen this this um, collection up close yet. So this is my first time actually seeing it as well up close. But, um, ooh, boo boo. I have my fun, very, very outgoing days and this catches my eye i love blue i mean you guys can tell i love to wear blue it's not my favorite color but it's like my favorite color to wear so i will wear this in a heartbeat mm. what is one thing you really want to achieve one thing i really want to achieve i want to leave a legacy in this world with film with fashion with who i am mm. most outrageous outfit you ever wore excuse you okay <laughs> <laughs> favorite tv show of all time Ah, um, I feel like I cannot pick one. However, I just watched Money Heist and it blew my mind. Come guys, you are about to be blown away. Can't wait. When were you the most nervous? When was I the most nervous? Uh, quitting my job and deciding to go to film school. That has been the hardest thing. Do you regret it now? No, it's like the most, if I could go back, I would tell them any chill. This would be the most amazing, you know, choice you're going to make. It's been worth it. Not that it's been easy, but it's been worth it. Mm. What's your number one dating rule? Number one dating rule. Um, be yourself. It's better to, you know, be who you are right off the bat. So you know if you can find chemistry or connection and take it from there. Do you believe in love at first sight? I do. I do believe in love at first sight. I'm cheesy like that. Okay. Are you in love? At the moment, with Jesus, yes. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite beverage? Um, favorite beverage. I like chocolate, so anything chocolatey. I don't think I have one particular one. Craziest rumor you ever heard of yourself? Um, craziest rumor. Oh, I don't know. I don't pay attention. Oh, I'm so sorry. I don't have an answer to that one. What is something you can't do but really want to learn? 
swim. I love bikini so much. I'm the ocean girl. I love the beach. I love the pool. Unfortunately, I'm that person at the pool party that is just posing right by the pool. So I want to learn how to swim and I'm actually going to take lessons very soon. Okay. Favorite food to make? <laughs> you mean favorite food to eat? No, make. <laughs> um, okay, I think I make a mean seafood pasta. Okay, can we try some someday? <laughs> I don't know, if you guys are nice to me, <laughs> maybe. If you could hide in someone's closet, who would it be? Oh, that's such a good question. I don't know if I can pick just one. But, I would literally, if I had to pick one, I would go back in time and go to Catherine Hepburn's closet. She had the most amazing suits and I'm very into suits right now. Mm. Best compliment you ever received? <sighs> that I had a heart of gold. <laughs> do you really know? I do. If you could know the absolute truth to one question, what question would you ask? Say that again, I didn't hear that. If you could know the absolute truth to one question, what question would you ask? <sighs> oh. Ah. Uh, am I going to marry Jared Leto? <laughs> Um, what are the three things you have in your handbag? Aside your phone and your wallet, of course. Um, a lip gloss, which I just used. Tissue or blood paper, today tissue. And my power bank. Mm. What's your favorite ice cream flavor? I love anything with like chocolate chips. So vanilla and chocolate chip with like maybe some fudge. What was your favorite subject in secondary school? In secondary school, I excelled extremely in accounting and commerce, but I love literature. Okay, so if you could teach any subject now, would you be able to teach literature? I would teach you guys the art of film and fashion. <laughs> uh, would you ever date a fan, Edie? Say that again. I'm would you sorry, ever I'm date a fan? Would I rather date a fan? Would you ever date would a I fan? Would I ever date a fan? Um... I mean, I feel like you're asking me would I date a person that's outside an industry that loves me. That sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> what is one thing about you you wish people focused more on? Hmm. I, I feel like everything I exhibit right now, which is film, fashion, and my personality is what is kind of being focused on majorly, so I'm, I'm fine with that. Okay. Last question, Ini. Describe your life using a hashtag. In a hashtag? Oh, one hashtag is not enough. Iconic. All right. That's See ya. 37 questions? Mm hmm Wow, I did so good. Now I'm going to go back to The Bachelor and cry my eyes out. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.